This is Brian Crabtree with Your Music Magazine. I'm here at the Your Music Magazine office. Today is March 22nd, 2010. I'm here with the guys at Pariah Fraction. How's it going, guys? It's going well, thank you. Sweet. Well, can we start with a little introduction? Name, role in the group, other bands you're in? My name is Eric Ocho. I am the drummer in the group. I uh, occasionally lift bricks as well. Private parties. Uh, I'm in the Dead Ringers, Bloodprint, and I do a little project called May 89th with Brian and this guy called Gizmo, who also do this tattoo. Sweet. Morgan Pax, uh, lead vocals. Birthday yeah. boy. Birthday That's right. Boy. That's right. Birthday today. Um, We're going to spank him. On rhythm guitar, I'm also in the Dead Ringers, I sing with these clowns right here. That's right. Sweet. Cover band. And I'm Nick, and I uh, play bass for Pariah Faction, and currently that's my only band right now. Sweet. I'm Brian. I play guitar for these guys. I also play guitar for the Dead Ringers with those two guys. And uh, also with May 89, too. And uh, it's a lot of fun. Sweet. So, with being in so many different groups, does it cause any strain trying to get together and practice then? Or are you guys yeah, just practicing Yeah, we have everywhere? a big calendar. We have, to, we have a big... Uh, a big cross-sectional, everybody's doing this on this day, so we can't do this here, so we have to come over here and do it here. But it works out really good. It's cool because, you know, everybody keeps their chops up, and everybody uses their equipment so much that they know it always works, you know? <laughs> when we were in the Dead Ringers together, and our old singer quit, and you guys know the Dead Ringers, we've done a lot of stuff for your music magazine. So they... You remember our old singer, Chuck? Uh, we needed a singer, and we knew him from the competitions, so we said, hey, buddy, and he began singing for us, and it worked out really well. And then as it turned out, uh, one by one, we sort of invaded these guys' band and kind of did a hostile takeover. And uh, Yeah, they raped, they pillaged, they that's did right. that stuff. They said, you know, they've got a band over here. We could, we could like, come I'm, on in. So, and, yeah, I'm since, the, <laughs> since the set lineup has changed, uh, who's new to the group and what happened to the old guys? Well, <clears throat> Brian here, our guitar player, is new, and Eric... Ocho over here is, is new, and Paul, our drummer, um, was raped by a pack of wild rhinos. And, <laughs> and uh, you know, it's, it's a real tragic thing, what it's happens with it's drummers. Laugh, yeah, you it's know? better than a bizarre then, gardening accident. Uh, you know, uh, Paul, uh, our guitarist, had an incident uh, while he was washing his dog naked, and he had a... Uh, Guitar inserted anally <laughs> and was damaged permanently. From While the all bed. these things happened, so, I was home in bed. Yeah, that's right. So you know. So, so this all guys, happened within a few weeks of each other, a few days. Yeah. 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 That's right. I think yeah. I think the Paul thing happened as a result of the or the Brian thing happened as a result of the Paul thing. I think he was just really depressed. And, Honestly, uh, we saw I saw the Pariah Faction play at a Dead Ringers gig. We were playing with them, and I said, "That's a really cool band. That's kind of like what I like to do because you, you got you probably remember Plaster too. We won in." Oh seven, I think. I believe so. Yeah, and uh, we were far more heavy metal than any of this stuff. And I was sort of in a mode to get away from that and do something else that maybe more girls liked. And less dudes standing around doing like this. <laughs> and more people actually having fun and stuff. Yeah. And maybe music that was just more fun for the general public and less uh, esoteric. And just metal. hatred. Chill. Well, uh, with the new lineup, and everything has that changed the sound or style of the group. I think yeah, guys... it has, and it's it's been a dramatic improvement too. Um, you know, just uh, the way you know every band. You know, there's a feel that you get with the members of the band, and sometimes it's a harder thing to create music in that in that area, and other times it, it's easy. And with these new guys, it's just easy. These guys are great, and we bring something different to the table to them. But I mean. All the music in the band is written by these two guys, and Morgan being the lead singer, I mean, he writes a lot of the vocals and stuff, and I'm just glad to be here backing them up. It's a it's it's a different thing for me to not be the main songwriter. That's always been my gig, so I'm kind of like coming in sideways with the creativity, like bringing it in from the side, which is cool because it's different. Definitely, yeah. It's a, lot, more fun. A, lot, a lot of the songs are right, or Nick and I write, or I write, and I'll bring to the table. But there's a things the chords, that are... a lot of the chords are super basic. They'll just have a real basic setup. And then he'll throw the flare in there, and then Nick will feed off of it, and then this guy will come up with some. Right. Group I mean, honestly, there's that, stuff that, that I, mean, I do. Right, music in general, though. Right. There's stuff that I do, and Eric does now. That's part of the song. You couldn't have the song without it. Now, you yeah. know what I mean? Right. Yeah, it's we, all. We changed it's a, it's, it enough. It's a yeah. good melding of the minds. We make yeah. a good fit. Yeah. So, with the new group, have you guys been working on or about to release any material? Yes. In fact, there's laying on them. Yes. Uh, uh, as of yet, untitled, but we got a really nice sounding little. 
that one coming it's out. Prior faction, prior faction. Yeah, Seven and, and uh, what the consensus is is that we're gonna uh, use the form of the when we play in the battles of the band, we're gonna call that our CD release party at the same time. I've been uh, chill. So that's gonna be uh, April thirtieth at the Catalyst in the green room. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, how do you guys feel about competing in the 2010 Olympics? Uh, I'm excited. Really I'm ready. We've done it the last few years. We've gotten we've gotten a good chunk of people the last few years, but I feel like this is our year. It's For time. sure. Yeah, we've got a good following. It's been continuing to increase, you know, show by show. And uh, have they the have ever the fans before. like the change in the band? And they're going. Yeah, yeah, I've heard nothing but good stuff. You know, they could be lying too. But I don't <laughs> think so. I got ears too. So. It's kind of cool that I mean. This is like the first non-metal band that I've been in that's not a cover band, you know. And uh, so the, the Olympics is going to be very different, you know, because I'm not going to play a lot softer and shit. But I kind of bring a little metal to this group. Uh, you, you yeah, you can thump. Yeah, yeah just I bring yeah, some flavor. Yeah. Well, uh, are you guys going to be touring at all here in 2010, or what's your guys' plans? Well, um, we just signed on with major promotion with the company that's um, <clears throat> down in L.A. that at this time we need to keep confidential. Um, Understandable. But, uh, uh, that's kind of what's prompted us into recording our new CD and making our new music video. Um, <clears throat> is is setting up for that, and they promote um, shows uh, locally, you know, within the states and overseas. Uh, are you guys working on the music video, or you guys have it already done? What's We've going on? We made some with great that? videos that are being edited right now, and one of them is uh, available on YouTube. Uh, one and a half. One and a half. <laughs> uh, go search YouTube. Uh, is that done? Wait, wait, hold on. Are we calling that finished? That's a complete video? I'm not... It's good enough for right now. Yeah. I made the video. They're like uh, critiquing me. <laughs> I thought it was So it's great. a work it's in progress there. Yeah, no, definitely. I would call it shit. 90, 95, huh? Yeah. I'm so, busy yeah, working on this porno, so I gotta divide my time. Yeah, right. Yeah. 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 Tyrone's only available Tuesdays and Thursdays. Anyways, it's Sally That's Take a... One. That's the one you Is that it? Sally Take One? Yeah. yeah. Whether or not it's done, you can see it. Okay. It gets more done. It's the bootleg version. Where where can people find out information about the band? At uh, myspace.com uh, forward slash pariah faction. P A R I A H F A C T I O N. Yeah, and the video is also, the rough cut of the video is also on that site. Sweet, sweet. Well, um, you were talking about your artwork and stuff. Just wondering who does your tats. Um, I got all these when I was, uh, like 17 and 18, so this one I got uh, from this guy named Scooter in Massachusetts. This one's fresh from my buddy Gizmo, and uh, I got this one from a guy named Nomi. Joe, Mike just had me question you on that. Um, Anybody else got any ink? Giz Gizmo did this. Gizmo did my big black chunk right there. Gizmo's a great bass player. Actually plays bass for Gabby Lawler, which trips me out completely. Oh yeah, we got to give shout outs. Uh, Pride Subject, Counterclockwise. Um, Granted all those Earth. assholes in blood print. Um, anybody else? Granted Earth for being so easy on the eyes. <laughs> 39 <laughs> fingers. <laughs> well, is there any uh, last words or anything you guys want to say to the fans out there? April 30th, Catalyst, come on out. That's right. Let's rock. Every band up there rocks. I, I almost don't even. It's like I, I love, I love the, the idea of us all getting together. It's, I know somebody's got to win. Every band, every, I always feel like every man up there is rocking, you know? It's like, you know. Of course, you know, if we lose, I won't be saying this. For sure. Well, thanks for making it into the office, guys. Thanks for having us. Thank you.